All right, guys, it's your boy, Nate. We are here with the Apex Season 2 ranked goodies that are coming out. And I am going to go over some specifics on it, what I think is good about it, um, and then some opinions after the fact. So right off the bat, I think this is a great play on Apex. One, it brings good incentive for people to play the game. Two, it gives people a goal, a purpose. Uh, myself, I like having something to work for and having the ranks all the way up to Predator gives me something to work for. So I'm really excited about it. Um, I'm trying to get really good at Apex and I just think that it's a great move and something that I'm very excited about. Uh, so with that said, there are some specifics um, to the ranking system that I think are super important to learn about. And that is one thing that I'm going to go over in this video. Now we are streaming right now. I'm doing this live. So if I get choked up a little bit, bear with me. We're going to try to one take this beast and uh, we'll see where it goes. But um, all right. So basically the goal of here, we're going to switch scenes. So you can see what I'm looking at. Um, the goal of doing this ranked uh, league type stuff that Apex is dropping is a few things. This is straight from the Apex website. Uh, they just dropped this information a little bit earlier. Uh, they want basically to reward people for being here in Apex. So uh, they're kind of doing that in a way of like rewarding us for putting in the time and effort to get good at the game and whatnot, which I think is super awesome. And then more importantly, um, it is letting us see where we stack up against other players. Cause like kind of right now, you don't really know where you're at. Like you don't know if you're above average, average, below average. Uh, so it's just nice to know like where you stack up at, you know what I mean? Um, so I'm really stoked about it for that reason. Uh, and, but more importantly, just to try to move up and, and work towards something. I think it's awesome. Um, so here are the specifics, right? So um, we have series, which is basically they're gonna, they're gonna launch the, um, the ranked series and it's not gonna be just one infinite thing. They're gonna reset it every once in a while. So right now, uh, they're going to be letting it go out to the end of season two, and they're going to make a decision on if it needs to be longer, shorter, etc. Uh, after the fact. <clears throat> um, so the ranks, there's six ranks. There's bronze, silver, gold, platinum, diamond, and apex predator. Each one has different tiers. If you look right here, gold four, three, two, one, uh, gold one, right? Just like it says is the top. So each one of those, except for predator has its uh, it's tier, which is also really cool. Cause then it's like, you know, you're not just gold. You're figuring out where you're at in gold or platinum, etc., where you're going to head to the next spot. Um, so I think that is <clears throat> really nice. And it's instead of having just the six, uh, you know, the six ranks, it's kind of like having, what is that? 20 plus ranks in a way. Um, another good thing. I don't think it says it right here, but I read it earlier. If you make it to diamond, for example, and then you lower back down to platinum, you still keep the diamond rank. It doesn't lower your rank. So that's super cool also. It would be a little more competitive if it went down, uh, but at the same time, it's like, you know, if you make it, it's like, you want that badge, you know? Um, the scoring, this is super, super important. Um, the scoring is all based on RP or ranked points. So it costs to get into each ranked match and the higher the rank you are the more it costs that makes sense bronze is free one rp for silver two rp for gold three rp platinum four rp diamond and five rp for apex predator uh, i think those are pretty sweet and i think it's a good way to kind of balance out where you're at with your rank because if you're doing really good against really good people you should get rewarded if you're not doing good you know you lose your you lose your stuff so you get one rank point uh per kill max of five now we'll talk about that uh, at the end because I think that's a little bit odd, um, but we'll talk about that at the end. Uh, placing top 10 worth two RP, top five, four, top three, seven RP, um, and a win will get 12. So that's, uh, go for the wins. <laughs> uh, what is this? So if you finish in top five, you won't earn six RP for top 10 and top five finish combined. Okay, so that's basically just telling you that you can't get stacked uh, rank points on top of each other. So if you get five, you're getting five, not 10 and five. Um, 
you have to be at least level 10. That's pretty easy to get to. You can get that in a, in a quick hour or two of decent playing if you want to restart a new character. Um, this is where it's talking about where uh, you get to keep your badge. So if you make it to platinum, you get to keep platinum even if you drop down uh, to the to the lower rank. Um, now the rewards, each, each one of these has its own rewards and they're not super big or anything. Uh, it's mainly you get recognition and it's kind of like a, you know, Hey, look, I, I, uh, I made this rank. I think that's the biggest part of it to me. Um, but you do get skins and some other rewards, which is cool. Penalties. <clears throat> I don't like when I'm playing with randoms and someone gets downed like right in the game, right in the beginning of the game and they just leave. So if you do that in a ranked match, you get penalized for it, which I think is great. Um, <clears throat> so if you die, it does say in here uh if you if you don't get your plaque picked up that you can leave the game or it, it, it doesn't say that but it doesn't say anywhere that you get penalized for that it only says uh if you check out right here um leaving while you are alive and leaving when you are dead but can still be respawned by teammates it doesn't say anything about leaving after you've uh you've died and no one's picked up your plaque <clears throat> so i think it's safe to say you can leave without getting penalized for that uh, there is a loss forgiveness. It's similar to the elite queue. Um, I don't know if you guys saw that. If you uh, if you happen to get um, downed and out from Apex Elite, it does give you loss forgiveness, but it ends your streak. So it's similar in this instance because you're able to get uh, say say you lose in right here for example it says platinum. Um, you'd normally have negative two adjustment to your P, to, to your rank points negative four is platinum but you get kills so basically if it costs four points to get in but you get two points it's only negative two you, so your kills count towards your score so if you were to get four kills um it's kind of like you counteracted the entry cost if that makes sense um again if they're going to be making updates to this and Obviously, there's probably going to be some issues starting off. Um, hopefully, they address them quick, and I hope everything works out well with it because I'm very excited for the ranked. Um, <clears throat> I do have an opinion. Um, I believe that having a max of five kills for five ranked points is an odd idea because if you get five kills, say you land in Skulltown and you get five kills right off the bat, you know, you pick up a Peacekeeper or an R301 or just something to slay out on people and there's a couple squads there and you got the you know the best weapon you could you could knock out five real quick what is going to stop people from camping till the very end of the game even if they're not super great or um <clears throat> you know that they're in a situation where they could fight other teams throughout the whole game but they're going to sit back and kind of camp it out or wait it out because they get more ranked points if they're at the end of the game I feel like you should be able to get ranked points for every kill, no matter if you get five or 20. I feel like you should get ranked points for every kill. Um, so I don't know what the idea behind that is. That's kind of my only negative that I can think of right now. Um, I hope that everything works out well with this and I'm very excited again. So um, let's, let's hope that our boys at Respawn are uh, on top of things and they listen to us and that's it for now uh, i hope this helped out somebody i'm really excited again i hope you guys are excited um if you haven't already hit that sub button hit the sub button hit that follow it helps out tremendously and i will be forever grateful um i do stream on twitch uh my, I, currently i'm on monday wednesday friday night um i would love to see you guys in there and again i really hope this helps somebody it's your boy nate alpha tube we are out peace